got the controls. ZX. There we go. No, I'm not into rest. Little sister, fuck you. Little <laughs> sister. Anywho, yeah, try attack gaming. Yeah, but whatever. Fucking bitch. <laughs> My name's Simon. <laughs> Good intro, consistent. Just the break. Yeah. Do it properly. <laughs> ah, welcome back to Try Attack Gaming. I'm Simon. My name's Tom. And I'm Max. And this person's a bitch. <laughs> little sister. <laughs> little sister, my ass. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so offended by that. It's like, she doesn't look like she's older than us. How old is she? Uh, probably in her 20s. Ugh. We're 10. Oh, yeah, we are, aren't we? I keep. I always forget that. We're fucking 10. Yeah. What the hell? Doing this stupid ass adventure for no apparent reason. Ugh. Enter. Enter. Yeah. You good? Cause is it just me? It looks like we have boobs. <laughs> Am I the only one who isn't seeing that little shadow there that implies boobs? I mean it might just be the top. You sure? I mean, ten-year-olds develop, don't they? Okay, no. Let's, let's move on from this before. I don't know. I don't have a kid. I don't really think about it. <laughs> it's okay. This right. is a risky topic. We should probably yeah. Let's it. leave. Yeah. Let's leave. New new topic. New topic. Um, worst Pokemon. Fuck, that's a good. We, one. What are we doing today? Like, we're being up the SSN. Look at this guy. This let's let's but, sail yeah. this ship. So yeah, we thought of a topic to discuss today. And we want your opinion in the comments as well. Who do you think is the worst Pokemon? So your least favourite Pokemon. It doesn't have to be the worst stat-wise. doesn't have to be the worst competitive. doesn't have to be anything like that. Just what you dislike the most about a Pokemon. So we're going to start this off with Max. Mine is Samurott. Made no freaking sense. Oshuot. Yeah, great. Duop. Yeah, great. Bigger swords. And then it got four legs. Yeah, it kind of evolved yeah, that way. To be fair, made no sense. Oh, yeah. fucking use raw. It had ah! potential. Ah! Use raw. Oh, no, get out. Get out. Get it out, had so out, much potential out. to be this dual wielding yeah. samurai, and it kind it, of it goes down on four legs. How do you wield a sword when you've got flippers instead of hands? Yeah, it had hands. Then we're back to flippers. That's, it that's just looked like a unicorn seal it just, hybrid. It was. I, I wasn't keen on it. I mm. loved it. Played with Oshawa loads, and then I just kept it as a duo. I mean, I, I remember Samurott was because I hated the look of Embor. Oh, that was and, my second choice. And Sir Superior, I've only recently got love for. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I always used to go with Oshawa just because, like, best of a bad bunch. Yeah. Until but you. then I was never keen on Samurott, but it was always half decent in game. It got. a Decent move spread, you know, we've got like X Scissor and Swords Dance and you know, you could go to town on things if you if they let you set up. But yeah, it, 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 it did kind of I never really understood the whole evolution, like it went from an otter to a, a sea sl basically. slightly larger otter and then to a, a sea lion. Yeah, yeah, sea lion. It was just like with a fucking horn on its head. Like the shell completely went, like you can yeah. see with Oshawa, the shell in its chest was there, and then yeah. that just that just disappeared. That was supposed to turn into a that, sword. Yeah. yeah, it was meant and to then, be a samurai sea otter. That was yeah. that's so cool, samurai otter. And then it just went on its head and somehow got longer and was, was a horn. It's almost like yeah. they already had samurai, and they're like, okay, what can we put this to make? There's the need run. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, no, I I completely agree. Yeah. It was um, yeah, it was very strange. Mm. Oh, that's a Pokemon itself, it was half decent. Oh yeah, but just the whole nature of it yeah. didn't really make sense. Now, see, I'm glad you went Samrock, because I'm going to go Embor. Oh, I was going to go Because oh. the third consecutive firefighting Pokemon Without starter, specific moves. So. And it wasn't even good at it. It's like, okay, we're already sick of this typing. Blaziken was cool. The it best. was weird they did it twice in a row with Infernape, but those two Pokemon were cool. And you bring out Embor, which is just like... It's shit at something you've already done well twice. Why do you even try and do it a third time? Yeah. And then you fuck it up. Yeah, again, I, I, yeah. It was, out of all three of them, it's still a decent Pokemon again. Like, I mean, the starters are always decent. Yeah. But this was just such a... And its shiny's quite cool. I do like its shiny, because it just turns... It, it should have been like that from the start, with the blue flames around it, rather mm. than from the red. But, yeah, it, it was always kind of... Never going to be as good as... Infernape is incredible. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Blaziken, just 
OP. Inc- incredible speed boost Blaziken, it's, Iron Fist Inferno, just a brilliant... Isn't Mega Blaziken on the ban list? It is, yeah. So, and, yeah. Bla- and Blaziken is, is as well, one of the only, I think... That non-legendary, Greninja, non-mega yeah, bans. Uh, that and Greninja with Protean uh, were both banned, whether they still are or not. But, um, yeah, definitely Blaziken was. Um, yeah, again, Ember was just kind of... Was just there, wasn't it? It wasn't. It wasn't anything better than what we've already had. It wasn't anything worse than what we've already seen. It was just sort of mm. here it is. It, it, it just pissed me off, and they <clears> went <throat> that same typing three yeah. times in a row. Yeah, it, they they thought like the big thing was you were revealed Victini. Like really, I remember when Black and White was like revealed as uh, coming out. Victini was like the main one because it's the first fire psychic type. So you thought. Oh, well, maybe they're going to do a fire psychic starter, or maybe they're going to do a fire dark starter, because that would be pretty good. We've only had Houndoom for that. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's all I can think of off the top of my head. But then they just kind of went, well, obviously Victini's got to defeat the fire starter. So it seemed, well, that's not what they've said, but that's what it seemed like to me. So it was just like, well, it's kind of a bit crap. Like, mm. it's, it's happened too many times, but. Yeah, it's, a, it's definitely a funny. Yeah, one. Gen Five was for me the weakest gen. Yeah, yeah, yeah um, definitely, definitely. I think I feel like they tried to do too much and didn't do it well enough. Yeah, like they tried that they went through this whole thing of we're just gonna completely get rid of all the Pokemon you know and love at the moment. We're gonna hopefully you're gonna get some Pokemon that you know and love in this generation. Which yeah, great. Haxorus, amazing Pokemon. Oh, brilliant. Excadrill, brilliant mm. Pokemon. Ferrothorn, competitively is. Outstanding. Superior was Superior actually really good. Is, is is one of my favourite starters now, right? But then you look at the likes of I don't know, like the, what was it? Um, Lizzie Vanillux, for example. Like that's one oh, of my what? least favourite, just because it. I know everyone says like, oh yeah, but if you look at Gen One, there's one that's based off a of Pokeball. Yeah, but that's because it was fresh, it was new. There's one that's based off a of Magnet. That it works. It's cool. Like it's. <laughs> A sentient a nice, ice cream cone. It's it's fu- it's food. Like these things are actually inanimate objects. They are they do not exist. And I know you can say that food is inanimate, but I didn't know food, food is well, something that you eat. And it's it's like these were just things you could pick up. Yeah, like, and, could you eat a vanilla? No, and it works. Like, I know muck and grimer are based off like literally trash, but then trubbish. Trubbish oh. looks dumb in my opinion. I love Garbodor. Garbodor oh, is, yeah, is in in terms of a good poison type Pokemon. Poison type is one of my favourite types, and I feel like it gets trodden down a lot. But I think that Garbodor is actually, if you can use it in the right way, it's quite a good Pokemon. The only problem is that you have the weaknesses against Psychic and Ground type, which are prolific in competitive and in most Pokemon games towards the end. So. It's it is a strange one for me, like. Mm-hmm. But I think my least favorite. Segwaying on. Yeah. That, that, yeah that, after that favorite. rant, let's so, start a new so rant. Quite, quite a way. I cannot stand Badu. <laughs> oh. See the point. Everyone had no, one. No, sorry, not Badu. Um. Uh, what's it? Sunken. Sunken and some flora. <laughs> I hate Sunken. Some flora. I dislike. I know. Chlorophyll, Solar Beam, it's supposed to be like one of the best things ever. It's not, it's ass. They are, Sunken has the weakest stats and looks, to, he's alright, he's cute, but he just looks so dumb. And he holds no benefit to your team. You have to wait until you can get a Sunstone in Gen 2. That takes forever. And you've got to sit there with this piece of ass yeah. in your team until you can sit there and go, oh, I'll evolve it into something that's half decent. I'm going to get rid of it in the next gym, though, because it might do me well against bloody Polyrath, but that's it. And you sit there and you're just like, what is the point? And if you evolve it early enough, so it won't learn Solar Beam. It's main thing. It will not learn because you sit there and you're just like, I really don't want this in my party. So you I have to get rid of this. You have, to, you have grind. to sit there, grind it, evolve it when it's at that level. I think it's like 32 or something in Gen, Gen 2. And it's still shit. Oh, fuck yeah, it's... Brick Break. Oh, very oh, nice. That's God. really good. If only we had fucking Spanky! Oh. Don't, uh, Stroke it off. Spanky. Oh. 
Yeah, so Badoo. Uh, not Badoo. I keep saying Badoo. I <laughs> like Badoo. Why am I saying Badoo? Rose Raid's amazing, but yeah, some flora and sunken. Sunken more so than some flora. Some flora's actually got some use to it. Yeah, sunken's just shit. Ugh. It's just ass. <laughs> Ugh. So, I mean, I've, I've been watching the screen, but I don't really know what we've done. We've taken on a I've few... I've been a few trainers, got a few levels. Nice. Literally, yeah. Nothing particularly exciting. SSN is kind of one of those just grinding... Yeah. Um, Not a very sort of... exciting location. No. It was fun. I'm pretty sure there's some stuff in the bins. I saw an odd bear in the trash. Whatever that was. Oh, I'm going to fucking go find it, bitch. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be good for Duck Trio. Where are them bins at? Where are them bins at? Just a berry. Just imagining like a one bite out of it. Cherry berry. Ugh, a half eaten cherry berry. Yay. Oh, can you imagine? Oh, God. <laughs> I picked this up. Pet your berry, that's good for poisons. That will help me ho. I feel smells every day. Oh, bo- what a boring life. Yeah. You're about to smell like it's a glutton. So are you, apparently. Look at you, you fat <laughs> fuck. Damn! Never trust a skinny chef. True, true. Oh, this bitch crying because of onions. Yeah, Be fair, though. It's not because his missus just left him and took the kids. <laughs> yeah, definitely not going through a tragic, heart-wrenching divorce. Paying his ass out of alimony and child support. Unless you've done that. Ooh. I have not, but you know, I'm just kind of meandering around. Don't go too far. Yeah, I just remembered. Yeah. What do we, what do we name our rival? Pete. Oh, yeah, Pete. Because he says for, Pete, for Pete's sake. But we've been calling him Gary the whole time, so... We'll, just, we'll call him Parry. Be it halfway. Piri. I, I call him bitch most of the times. Oh. Oh. What's this item? Is Machoke smaller than him? Jesus Christ. I forget how small Pokemon are. Yeah. Like, isn't Charizard supposed to be only like four feet tall? Four foot... Ten? Four foot eight, maybe? So I am like two whole feet taller than Charizard. That's, yeah. That's creepy. That's weird to think about. You're the same height as Dragonite. Oh. Ah. Huh. Sweet. You're not 6'10", are you? 6'7"-ish? Six, 6'6". Six, six, oh, Aw, horsey. This no. horse is adorable. Not okay. a good matchup. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bad matchup. What am I doing? Yeah. 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 Get dank. Get dank. Fucking warrior. Get dank. <clears throat> Send in dank. Yeah, here's one, here's one, here's one. The cutest Pokemon. While well, we're talking about cute ones, the cutest Pokemon. Ooh. The most adorable. Um. Ooh. That's tough. That's what a head Just based on appearance, or? Just appearance. No, no, no nothing else. There's the one that's the most. Aww. Oh, when you look at it. Ooh, there's so many though. There's like, loads. There's I know. Like, I've, I've, I've proper. That they're supposed to be adorable. Baby Skitty, you know, and arguably Jigglypuff, and I mean, if you think fat is cute, well, it's just the big eyes, isn't it? <laughs> True, the, the eyes, eyes, but they're very, re- they're very rotund. Eevee, but I think Eevee's got a little bit too much detail to be classed as cute. Mm. Um, I mean, personally, I'd probably have to go with. I, mean, I had one, but it's, uh, then I'm thinking, actually, I don't think it is. Oh, oh, that's shit. a hard one. That's a tough one. I'm going to go with Iggy Buff. Because that thing's freaking adorable. That is tiny and yeah. it's sweet. God, what a yeah. poison type. What do I, what do I use? Uh, margarine. A margarine. Yeah. Mm. I mean, Wigglytuff's good. It can, it can take a hit, but... It's just, and that, since it's had that fairy typing added to it, it's got rid of one of its main weaknesses, but it's not, it can't really deal out too much damage, but... We didn't say anything about that. No, but when you said it was a monster, it definitely is a monster, it's a pocket monster. Hey. Um, yeah, it's good, it is It is definitely good, and like for an early early stage team, you can just evolve it straight off yeah. with the Moonstone, and it will still do you well, like you could take it to the fifth or sixth gym in this. And it would still be there, like, yeah, I'm pretty good. Then you'd probably replace it, but... Hmm. I think for me, I think my cutest Pokemon is Mimikyu. See, I nearly said Mimikyu, but then you've got to think underneath. I don't care about underneath. He's a he's adorable and sweet and such a cute backstory. 
there. I think the backstory is really cute. Mm. The way they do it in the anime apparently is really quite sadistic. What? Like, he he's he's so jealous of Pikachu. He starts attacking him. So he joins up with Team Rocket. Yeah. What? Yeah. Mimikyu goes with Team Team Rocket is not deserving of Jesse Mimikyu. catches it. Fuck yeah. off. Yeah. yeah. Fuck off. This is the most angry I've ever been about anything Pokemon related. <laughs> Mimikyu's amazing. I do think Mimikyu's backstory of it wanting to be popular so it dresses up like the most mm. popular thing yeah. is, is really cute. But I see lots of fan art about Mimikyu dressed up as different popular Pokemon. Yeah. Like, like Eevee illusions. Yeah, all the Mimikyu Bulbasaur Eevees, all the Gen 1 starters. That'd be a cool thing to add in the next game. Like all these different mi- Mimikyu's for different starters. Would their yeah. typings change? No, it would still just be Mimikyu. It would just look different and you could collect all the Mimikyu's. I think I'd have to go for Mantyke. Mantyke? Yeah. So, ooh, I didn't even think of that one. I just find, I think his big eyes, his little flappy wings. <laughs> Does he actually fly? He is a flying type. Oh. But it, it's like Mantine, he doesn't fly. Hmm. But he's a flying type. But yeah, I, I just find him really cute and like adorable. I nearly said Skitty to be fair, but I thought Skitty's just always been one of those it's just kind of yeah annoying every time I see one I just think I could see you being a right pain in the ass in real life like you can see him being one of those really awkward cats mm. and you just sit there and you're just like nah, see Gang's quite far ahead in the levels so I'm tempted to use someone else but I don't want to risk anyone else Dank would just sweep right through these guys up against water types another whole thing so yeah Dank would just sweep right through it but he's already so many levels ahead I mean Let's go Pekka. You can put yeah. string out and then use Dank. Oops. Pekka or Pop Tart would be quite good. Oh, yeah, I mean, Pop Tart. Pop Tart, not so much, but it yeah, could do some damage. Throughout Payday, you get some monies. Mm. I mean, we're quite, you know, we're a few levels ahead, so I'm really, I'm just thinking about lo- balancing. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> yeah, I, to be honest, Horsey's quite a cute Pokemon. Horsey is when cute. When you think about it, like, so yeah, we've got two two things for you to answer today. What's the cutest and what's the uh, Most least your <laughs> the least shittiest favorite Pokemon? The but, um, biggest piece of actual garbage. Yeah. Without dissing garbage one and yeah. stuff like that. No, I mean you diss them. I, I know I, I know a lot of people would say they're their least favourites because they're literally based on trash. But yeah. What a, what a weird thing to base your Pokemon off of. Yeah. Of all the things, why? Um, I mean, uh, the basing the poison type off pollution in general, but <coughs> Garbodor is literally just a torn garbage bag. Yeah. My other choice was going to be Clef Key. It's a freaking key ring that can make <laughs> solar beam. Oh, that's Why? so weird. It's a but key ring. Clef Key's so good. I know, but the like, concept... Doesn't that just kind of salt the wound, though? Yeah. Look how shitty this thing looks. By the way, it's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. It's type and it's just, like, second to none. Fuck off with that steel fairy bullshit. Yeah, and then you've got... Is it one of your favourites, Marwal? Oh, Marwal! There you go! Marwal! Yeah, steel fairy bullshit? Yeah, that's that, what's that What was that about? <laughs> but Marwal pulls it off because he's fucking amazing. <clears throat> I think Clefki's what... annoying because it's competitive and looks like shit, and Marwal competitive and looks amazing. With those giant heads coming out of her head. Horns. I love them. She's so adorable. She, he. I always use refer to my more wild as she. She just looks like. Wait, it's based, well, it's based on a. Uh, yeah. Oh, I know the backstory. It's to this. based on a female. On a female that never ate, and, and then at night she, she ate you through the back, back of her head. head. Do you want Mark whirlwind? I'm gonna say no. Alright. Just because. Whirlwind's only really good for. I mean, oh, it could force the switch, and we are playing on set. We should have probably done that, but anyway. Move to it. We can, we can always learn it later on. Change. Ether, let's go kidnap someone. That's Ether, it's another word for I know, chloroform. I know. You've been a bit dark today, mate. Like, I have, I'm, I have. I'm, I'm, sli- I'm a bit worried about you with the way, way it started and the way it's. Uh. To be fair, Ooh, we, rest. Are, rest. we are rest. going through rooms stealing items of people. <laughs> we are drenched in Pokemon blood. We've killed a lot of stuff today. It's messing my mind. Ugh, tentacle. Fucking poison type. Yeah, yeah, good idea. Why do I even still have Gex up front? Yeah. We're on the SSN. Kind of a colossal tactical fuck up. Yeah. Get poisoned. Yeah. See, it worked. Reverse psychology. 
reverse psychology. I feel like luck plays a contributing role, but... Yeah, not as much as reverse psychology. <laughs> that is literally Pokemon's thing. Like, it's, it's all down to luck in the end. <laughs> I was watching the championships uh, the other day, and there was a, a crucial... I can't remember who it was, but this was from a few months ago. There was a crucial critical hit. And literally just completely changed, turned the tables in the battle. Mm. There was like a, a Lolan Nine Tails out there. There was a Snorlax, Tapu Koko, and then there was something else on on a uh, Garchomp, I think. And if the Garchomp had not hit, uh, it was something. But yeah, it just completely changed the game. And it was just like, well, jammy, that's why we play Pokemon, <laughs> jammy bitch. Yeah, it was. It was really bad. It wasn't just like a little. Oh well, it didn't matter that much. Because normally when it's like a critical hit, like, it's like a, yeah, at yeah, the yeah, end, you... it's like yeah, it's pretty good. But when it matters so much, and you just sit there and you think, you fucking ass. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, we could get a star you. Star me is pretty badass. But we can't. Are we, we in the wrong version? Yeah, oh, we, yeah. Fucking fine head. What do we get on this version then? I want to say Sand Shrew. Do no, we? I think that's Leaf Green only as well. Um, I think Sand Shrew was the other version of something else. Because they come in pairs, don't they? Yeah. Star you is paired with something else. Another, it'll be another water type. It'll be like Psyduck or something. Or Shelda. I think it's probably Shelder. Oh. Mate, if we can get a Cloyster. Cloyster. Not even, not even gonna lie. Oh man. Game done. Easy. Yeah. Keep that thing. Cloyster. Ah, oh, yeah, but it won't have skill link in this gen. It'll have like shell armor or something. Yeah. Which is it's still good, but it's not. Yeah, skill that, link. that tactic you're thinking of is later gen tactic. It's great. Yeah. Five hits every time. <clears throat> it's my favourite, favourite, favourite competitive Pokemon. Of like all time, I love it. It's all about the level one Rattata. I mean, level <laughs> one Rattata is just a. Uh, I've tried so many times on Showdown to make that work, but people just they don't know the tactic. <laughs> yeah. They know they see it and they're like, okay, yeah, I know what you're trying to do here. Tricky is to go with like thirty or forty. It's still low, but you can pull off some hits. Yeah. But it's um. Bless them. It's it's such a good, such a fun thing to do, and everyone hates you for it, and it's just like that <laughs> they're like, I, I want an actual them. battle here, but yeah. you know, you kind of just taking the piss. Stop it, stop it. Yeah. And then you got a uh, level one, was it nose pass? With yeah. Pain and split nose and pass sturdy. Pain splits. Yeah. <laughs> See, I've been ages trying to figure that one out, and someone pulled it on me. I was like, what? What? What is this? What? What? What is this? What's going on? What's happening to me? I don't understand. Yeah, you can literally win with, like, that. <laughs> you don't need anything else. I mean, I tried to, but people just, they, they fucking figured it out. They started using moves that hit more than once and statuses. So I just kept... Yeah, that's that's the big one. As soon as you get poisoned or toxic or something, then it just all, Every, it, it all falls apart. Everyone has one of those, don't yeah. they? You, you always take a Toxica. Yay, level 20. Do you learn anything good? Probably not. Nope. Learns nothing. I don't know what it learns in these later... Later levels. Yeah. I think it pretty much gets its full moveset by like 36. Or yeah. Something. It's a bug type. Battle 3 is not a late game Pokemon. Oh, no. Oh, no. It'll, it'll, it'll be done after Erekid. Yeah, I'll live its usefulness quite rapidly. Yeah. It will be good for Erica, actually. You know, bug flying, got confusion for all those part really, poison types. It'd be really good for Erica. It learns gust someone, doesn't it? Yeah, um, unless we got rid of it. No, because we, we would have got rid of it for tackle, wouldn't we? Yeah, we, if we still have tackle, we would still have, we have got rid of We would have had gust. Oh, yeah. Bleh, can't speak. Neither can stars. Got no face. is not got no face. Alright then, that'll do for today. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, tell more than one friend. Tell everyone. Just don't tell the world. But probably not friendly enough for your mum. I mean She doesn't want to know what you're listening yeah. to with a swearing and all that. But. but yeah, thank you very much for watching guys. That'll do. Cheers guys. Bye.